Red Bull Arena, the New York Red Bulls host longtime rival DC United in a match that will determine the Atlantic Cup, the annual title for the winner of its Eastern Conference Series. United in a game that features the top two scores in Major League Soccer for Red Bulls. That's Thierry Henry who leads the way with nine. United, well, it is Charlie Davies who is doing just what they hoped he would when he came to D.C., and that is score goals. This is a real rivalry. It's not a manufactured one. So if you're a Red Bull, go attack, go get the win. Now, ball into no man's land. Medi Bucci runs onto it for Henry. McCarty making a run on the right. Henry steps aside. Ethan White, his shot blocked. Clyde Sims getting in the way, but now Limpair on the left. Squares across, won't find Rogers, but the ball comes out. Richards touches over to McCarty. Miller getting involved in the offensive third. Henri and Limpair together. Henri just slides it wide. Well, it's good. First time passing in a tight space. Miller plays it in, Limpair with a little flick, wanted to give and go, but he dragged the defender with him, so Thierry Henry tries to slide it to the far post. He is so elegant, Thierry. With your central defenders. Yeah, and the longest tenured Red Bull player right now, so he's been valuable to this team. Drives it ahead. Henri brings it down into the box, chipping it over a mean, and it's just too heavy. Now Thierry Henry looks back to Tim Reen and gives him the thumbs up. And if you saw the game against Toronto FC, there was a similar situation with a long ball over the top, and Tim Reen did not put it in the right spot. And Thierry Henry turned around and shouted at him. Limpair sets up for the corner kick. Keeps it low, Henri. Back to Joel Limpair. And there's the cross. I'll try to see if he can put it up and over the defense. Couldn't quite pick out Bellucci now from distance. Oh, dangerous shot from Jan Gonarsoli. Right now, DC United has slowed it down. But as you said, if this was a road game, you'd say this is exactly what Red Bulls should be doing. So conversely, fair play to D.C. United. Now slipping through, Davies touches by Sutton, the goal wide open, and Ream saves it up the line. Well, we've seen Tim Ream do this before. And when your goalkeeper comes out, if you're a defender, put your head down and run back to the goal mouth. That's what Tim Ream does. He'll put his arm up for a moment, thinking that it was offside. I didn't see another player for Charlie Davies to try and square that ball to, but desperate moment for Red Bulls. And DC United's first quarter comes to Pontius, and he heads it wide. it ahead and neither Lindner or Rogers got there. Now Di Rosario from distance right into the arms of Sutton. They distribute wide left and Miller. Paul Re as we see who is available for Ben Olsen for BC United. Fred Brazilian who has one more game after this before he heads to Australia. time in MLS will be over. And they have attacking options off their bench, DC United. Charlie Davies often has been subbed out. And now foot race here. Henri gets there. Amin gets a hand to it. And Rogers can't get there in time. Well, I'm loving Thierry Henri because after he's denied, he's talking to the crowd. At the south end of the field, the supporters' clubs. He's saying, "Make some noise! Let's get, let's get our team into the game." Excellent agility by the big man. We talked about it before, Joe. For about 6'3 and 225, that's good quickness getting down to his left. Is there? Is it? I thought would be there. Is it? Maybe 
what it's going to be. Well, I think that's part of it, Joe, but I also think it's because Thierry Henry has not sat deep in the mid midfield as a playmaker, and neither Lynn Pierre or Dex. Bacardi has gotten forward. Now, Bellucci, shot deflected. Rogers running onto it. He skips by Amid, but checks up for him, and he scoops it up. Well, I'll tell you, I like this kid, Bill Amid. Again, a big physical presence, aggressive off his line. This is the opportunity to poke in a goal, but you're facing a very athletic keeper that's challenging you at the edge of the six-yard box. And so goal's clear. Well, that's why it'll be interesting to see if Juan Agadello comes in, who it's for, Joe, because Wolf has been quiet. Oh, the dummy through by De Rosario. Wolf returns it off the post and in. Dwayne De Rosario in his return to Red Bull Arena puts DC United up 1-0. And that's what I was about to say. As long as you've got Josh Wolf, De Rosario, and Charlie Davies in the lineup, you can't afford to gamble. And this is a nightmare for Red Bulls. De Rosario with the step over, continued his run. He went inside Roy Miller. That's just great individual effort by Dwayne De Rosario. Started the play, continued his run, gets the goal. How many times have we seen this man do something like this in a dramatic moment? Pulled off a corner on Wednesday night. Beautiful header. Lynn Pair had the service just like he does now. Up into the air, punched away by Amid, comes to Soli. Slides over to Miller. Has it knocked away. Now trying to recover. Will he get to it in time? Out it goes, but a foul and a card. Miller upset. McCarty sets up the corner. And here it is. In swinger. Sutton for the header. Knocked out by Soli, and there is the final whistle. DC United holds on for a 1-0 win. Dwayne De Rosario, the only goal of the match in his return to Red Bull Arena.